it's very cold in here. I'm conducting an experiment measuring the exothermal properties of hydrogen in sub-zero temperatures. Mum is playing with cold things. It's all very scientific. <sighs> Stay back, Cosmo. The slightest mistake could ruin the whole experiment. We thought you hard workers could do with a drink. I made water. Well, poured water. Well, salted. <laughs> My experiment! Months of work. Gone. Lovely drinks. Gone. Mummy sad. It's okay. It was only water. But it's frozen all over my experiment. It looks like an ice rink now. An ice rink? For ice skating. I used to love ice skating. Like a ballerina dancing on ice. Well, I'm too busy for ice skating these days. Gil, how long would it take to reset experiment conditions? Around seven months, four days, 11 hours, 22 minutes and 43 seconds. I'm sure I can find a quicker way. Your mum is the best ice skater I've ever seen. Even better than me, and I'm pretty fantastic. I have very strong ankles. I wish I could go ice skating. I got it! To finish my experiment sooner, I just need to take it somewhere incredibly cold. One of the coldest planets. Where are we going? Where are we going? I never do. Where are we going today? Where are we going to play? Where are we going today? Where are we going today? We're all going to Neptune, one of the ice planets. I'll prepare my equipment. An ice planet? Cosmo, there must be loads of places to ice skate there. Do you think so? Oh, there must be. Let's find out about Neptune. Hello, Cosmo. Kian here. This astronomer is going to tell us all about the planet Neptune. So pay attention. This is the solar system. And these are the planets. This one at the end is called Neptune. Neptune is a big blue planet. Neptune is the farthest planet from the sun. That makes Neptune terribly cold, one of the ice giant planets. So remember, Neptune is a big blue planet, farthest from the sun, and it's very cold. Could you please help me remember that? Neptune is a big blue planet, farthest from the sun, and it's very cold. Thanks. Cosmo out. Right. Everything's ready. And are you ready for ice skating? Begin launch sequence. <laughs> It cold for me and you. Past all the other planets, towards the solar system's end. The ice giant, giant Neptune, our cold and windy friend. <laughs> Neptune. <laughs> That's not Neptune. That's Jupiter. Neptune is very different. Will you help me show Neptune to Sol? Great! Let's draw Neptune. Neptune is round. But what colour is planet Neptune? Yellow, red or blue? Which crayon would I need? Blue! 
Neptune is a blue planet. That's right. This is what Neptune looks like, Sol. Neptune is a blue planet. Blue planet. Yes, like that planet. Oh, that is Neptune. Neptune is a blue planet, farthest from the sun, and it's very cold. So everyone needs to wrap up warm. Imagine an ice rink, disco lights. Well, they might not have disco lights, but as long as it's smooth and solid, we'll be able to skate. Who is flying the ship? The ship? Oh, the ship! <laughs> Entering Neptune's atmosphere now, all under control. Neptune is beautiful. So blue, so windy and swirly. Oh, I can't wait to go ice skating. Swish, swish. Swish, swish. Oh! No swish. <gasps> That's not smooth and solid. Be careful, everyone. The surface of Neptune isn't solid. Ugh. Gil, please extend the platform. Extending now. Thank you for saying please, I mean. It's only good manners, but it's still nice. Not solid. It's not like an ice rink at all. It's not even like the hard ground at home. Neptune's surface isn't solid. It's all smushy and mushy. Hey, that's something amazing to tell your friends. Neptune's surface isn't solid. Amazing! But not very good for skating. That is sad. Swish, swish. If only there was some way of ice skating out here. Well, no point in complaining. Unless there's a Neptune complaints department, which I don't think there is. To cheer us up, I brought water for everyone. Well. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't worry, I'm fantastic at not slipping on ice! Whoa. Ouch! <gasps> whoa. Ouch! Ouch! Just need to bring this very delicate equipment down to Mum. Watch out, Gil! It's very... <laughs> Slippy. Slippy like an ice rink. The water has frozen and turned to ice. Dad, we can go skating on the ice! Oh, we couldn't skate on a patch of ice as small as this, Cosmo. For a big ice rink, we'd need lots of water. Gil, how much water have we got? Approximately 5.7968. Gil, is it lots? Yes. Beginning experiment. What now? Now? We wait. Oh, if I'd known we'd be waiting, I'd have brought a book. Well, we can enjoy the peace and quiet. Surprise! My experiment! Not again! Go, Dad! Well, I wasn't going to ruin it twice, was I? An ice rink? Ice skating? Whoa! Whoa! Take my hand. I might fall. You might, but you'll get better. I don't know, Mum. I don't think I can do it. You can do anything, Cosmo. Really? Of course. Really? I can do it! That's right! <laughs> Would you like to skate, Sol? Take my hand.
Oh dear, is there danger? The experiment was a success, Gil. You did very well. I did? Really? I mean, oh, yeah, of course. I am a supercomputer, you know. Begin launch sequence! It cold for me and you. And we learned something amazing today. Neptune doesn't have a solid surface. It's all mushy. Past all the other planets with the solar systems end. The ice giant Neptune, our cold and windy friend. Too. Thank you, Dad. Mission complete! Now, would anyone like a drink before bed? Drinks? I'll get them. <laughs> <laughs> Whiz! The home of ABCs, 1s, 3s, and all your favourite kids' TV characters. Now let's find kids' TV. Or I can press this microphone. Whiz! That's how easy it is. <laughs>